Even before COVID, the government had racked up a massive and unsustainable deficit, expected to reach 76 billion by June this year. Already we are seeing signs that if the government's re-elected, its next budget will target hard fought for initiatives that make a real difference to people's lives, like the National Disability Insurance Scheme. They'll say that it's protecting taxpayers' money while they continue to fund for-profit businesses like the fossil fuel industry and other coalition government friends. Look, the NDIS is far from perfect, but we need to learn as much as we can from its few years of operation and make it the best possible scheme to support Australians with disability. Slashing funds to people in need is not the Australian way, and nor is funding your mates at the expense of the rest of us. As a society, we can choose a more inclusive and caring economy, and we demonstrate that in the members of parliament that we elect to represent us. I'm Nicolette Buller, Bradfield's Community Independent, and I'm ready to be your voice in Australia's parliament.